guys, I'm Crawlin, and welcome to Let's Play Pokemon Ruby. In the last episode, we did something. We we defeated um, this guy. We, we defeated Team Magma and Max of Team Magma. Before we're gonna start and do anything, we're gonna go to the shop and actually get some stuff because we need we are in a need for stuff. I'm gonna get at least um, around I would say 20 of these. Like we can afford it anyway, so. There's no need not to do it. Um, I'm gonna get, I'm gonna get five of these revives. I actually might have actually get ten. <coughs> also, have enough money for that. And we're going to um, get fifteen more of these, and we should be fine. And yeah, why not food balls, food great balls? I mean, like we need it anyways. Not like we're gonna catch that many Pokemon, but hey. Still, still handy in some uh, occasions. What we're gonna do as well is we're gonna head into this Pokemon Center and actually do the bath over, bath over here because it's a little special bath. There's an item in here, <laughs> and two old ladies. And I still have my clothes on because I am super fancy. Because why would you put off your put off your clothes if you are in a bath? Right? I don't know. Maybe because you're retarded. Oh well. Um, yeah. So what we're gonna do in this episode, we're going to beat the fourth gym, which is just downtown. Downtown actually, just in the town. Yeah, um, I'm gonna send a message quickly to someone and um, I'm gonna continue. Okay, and we can continue. So what I'm not gonna do, I'm not gonna skip uh, the trainers in the gym for a simple reason that is, um, it's not needed. Like, it's a gym anyway, so we wanna just play normally. Now, of course, if you know how Pokemon works, and if you know this gym anyways, you can actually talk to this guy, and this guy will explain you um, what type of gym, le gym leader is. But before we do anything, we wanna... No, I'm actually. This is good. Is this a hole? This is a hole. Oh. Okay. I wonder. Can I remember the exact order? No. Never mind. I can't. I I already uh, failed here. There's an exact order to go through, so you can get to Flannery. Honestly, I like this this way. Um, this this one a lot better than the um, remade version because this one is you can go through a lot faster to this one. Oh fuck! <coughs> I forgot, of course, that this was a fire gym, and of course, all Pokémon that have a different type of fire do know a fire move. I am so stupid. Okay, well, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try and um, shove back my box and see how well it goes without really fucking up the camera. And uh, Mike. So, because I want to sh change my sitting position because this is a lot better than. Uh, the other way around. Now, what I'm gonna do is gonna do double kick, and that should kill the Cacklean. Oh, it's fighting! Oh, that I forgot. Cacklean has that, so that's how it works. Critical hit! Don't hit me again! Don't hit me again! Thanks, Ember. Oh, seriously? Seriously? This is some pretty serious shit. Oh, wh why? Uh. Okay, um, now, you can see that I am not the most smartest person to, um, to be playing this game. But, my plan to rule the world starts here. Flamethrower to a water type Pokemon. That wouldn't really work that well. Hopefully. Fun burdens. Okay, at least you're a fire type now, so I can hit you with this, and this will be fine. And now you change to a, a um, electric type and uh, water type, so I can hit you with my electric type move. So get wrecked, Keklian. Get kecked. Boom! Shock wave. Boom! That should do a. Oh yeah, of course. I forgot about that. Fate attack, yeah, that's gonna kill me. Most likely. Yep. 
figured as much. Now, okay, it's an electric type, so I don't have anything against that. Um, uh, going up. I can always send out Satan and just try, try and hope for the best. Now, Satan does double kick and hopefully finishes out the Gaglion right now. Yeah, you, you changed the fighting type, and now again, and Gaglion is dead. This was a lot harder than I expected to be. To be. Now, we might, we might need to head back for um, something else. So, I'm gonna head back to, uh, to the thing. Boom! Rock, sky rocket up, and boom, there we go. We're gonna head back to the Pokemon Center because we need that. Now, this episode is gonna be fairly short, I would say. I would say around 20, 25 minutes, maybe 30. And then we are already at the next gym as well, so... Yeah, there is a really easy way to get to the next gym as well, so that's, that's a fun thing. Um, but it might actually take a little bit longer than I expected, so we'll see how it goes. Now, I, I'm pretty sure there's a trainer here, so what I'm going to do is actually... Um, how, how far are you with your leveling? Ah, fine. You're going to get one You're gonna get one more battle experience, and that's it. You're not going to get anything more. Hey, who are you? Oh, oh yikes, it's hot. No shit, why are you in the, why are you in the hole anyways? Like, I don't get why he's in that hole waiting for me. Like, it would make no sense, right? Let's wait in a really hot hole until I'm almost burning to death. Sounds like a good plan. Because the gym leader cares about its inhabitants. Yeah. Most likely. I don't think the gym leader really cares for its inhabitants. Trump again some level. Boom. Trump level 20. This is what I wanted to do. Slugma. Um... Nah, we can we can keep on going for a little longer because we can use two Pokemon in this uh, gym, so it's fine. Smog. Oh god, that's poison. That's poison. Yep. Am I? No, I'm not gonna be poisoned. Okay, then it was something else that did that. Poison gas. That was the one. Poison gas actually poisons the person. Doesn't do damage, but it poisons. Not good stuff. No more. Um. I don't have anything else to c Oh, actually, I do. But that was not, that might be not be a good idea in a uh, fire-type dungeon. I mean, gym. I, I keep forgetting this is not a gen dungeon, or, but a gym. Technically, you can see it as a dungeon, but it's not a dungeon. It's, you know, it's a gym. Dunge dungeons are a lot more complicated as well, so... Yeah. Okay, let's see what we get. And... Boom! Trump is evolving! Now, Trump will build the wall. He will build a wall around him. His own personal safe space. And he evolved into Linoon. Your Trump evolved into Linoon. Trump, I'm sorry. Right, I'm going to take from you. And I'm going to give it to... I would say Shrek. No, fuck you. Fuck, sh fuck you, Shrek. Give... I'm going to give you a... Um, experience share, which is all the way to the bottom, but I forgot it's all the way to the bottom. Also, this peeping sound is a lot, it's a lot harder than I uh, imagined. Boom. You know, the thing with Mawa is... Mawa is strong against something, but also weak at the same time. Okay, now this is the way to go. I think we can... It was this way, right? Yeah, I remembered it, right? Boom! Okay, then we go here. And then it was that one. Yep. Then you go all the way over here. And then, if I'm correct, you need to take the bottom parts. This one. Yep. Then over here, there is the, the one to Flannery. Yep. I still remember it, just like I was a kid. Ah, that's fun. Okay, let's see. Um, ah, take item. No. You know, I'm used to the newer games where you can just um, do that to heal your Pokemon. Um, let's use a Super Potion. No, actually, that's that's a waste of Super Potion. I'm going to use a normal Potion because we've got enough. 
Um, boom. Here we go. Now let's. Um, I think the first Pokemon is Slugma, so we're gonna so we're gonna start off easy. I notice person has over overheat. So that's a strong type move. So I'm almost fucked. So I'm not fucked. So I'm not fucked. Uh, so I am fucked if I uh, get hit by that. Welcome. No wait. Your new trainer. How good to see you've made it here. I have I have been entrusted with it. No wait. I am Flannery. I'm the and I'm the gym leader here. Uh, dare not underestimate me though. I have been the leader for only for only a short time. What skills inherited from my grandfather? I shall uh, demonstrate the hot moves we have honed in this land. On this, on this land. Okay, fine. Hot moves. Show me your hot moves. Show your moves. Flannery. I am almost flannered. Let's see. Let's do rock tomb. Should work. I hope. Please. Yeah. No. Oh, I'm fucked. I am fucked. Yeah. yeah, I am. Rest in peace, my well. Yeah, you know, I kind of figured that would happen. Special attack harshly fell. Wow. Oh yeah, of course that that was that's what overheat does. Gullible. <laughs> okay, we're gonna use water gun for gullible. Thanks. Bun. I really love this song. Um, sl another Slugma. Um, should I? Nah. I want to give, um, Thingy. Let's say, who was it again? I forget his name. I'm really sorry I forgot the name. Oh, wow. Well. Uh, imprisoned. I want to give that one another chance in here. Probably. Um, water gun? Yeah, why not? Let's do another water gun. Should be enough. Oh, critical hit, bitch. Super effective. Select my used light screen. Yeah, this is gonna be fun because, um. <sighs> I have potions. I will fully heal the Pokemon. And if I'm correct, every gym leader has two. Light screen uh, decreased the, attack, the damage it would get, so. It's also gonna be fun, so it's gonna take longer to kill this one. Rock slide. I almost forgot this Pokemon had rock slide. Fuck. Um. Yeah. I am fucked if I don't do anything. Okay, I'm gonna do. I'm gonna heal up. Flamethrower. Cool. Yeah, that won't work against me. Because I am the wing. What? Shit. That's complete bullshit. Rock slide. Y you can't kill me now. Unless you get a critical hit. Okay, is your light screen off? Fine, Nelly. Now I'm gonna use this one. I don't I know it probably doesn't work, yeah. Now you're gonna do well, more damage than I can take. Yeah, for some reason. You know what? Fine. I don't care. Take my water gun. Boom! Super effective rock slides. Yeah. I'm fucked. Anyhow. We go to the next Pokemon, which is Satan. No. Yeah, it is Satan. Satan is gonna be the next Pokemon. Okay, use your use your next uh, super potion. I mean hyper potion. Which is also your last, so you so you ruin it for your next Pokemon. Your next Pokemon is gonna die easily. I hope. Boom! Two double kicks in a row. That's a nice one. Critical hit. And not that I really need that anyways, but um thanks anyways. Um Torkoal. Nah. Gotta keep using this one. This one is strong enough. Double kick. Oh yeah, I forgot about this. Torkoal has a high defense. And it will cause... a lot of damage. Yeah. Lineud, um, please uh, shift in for now. We need something to, to back up. 
Hey, everybody slam. Please take it. Thanks. Now we're going to use the revive on whichever one is first, let's say. Imprisoned. Imprisoned died first, so also as privilege. White male privilege. Although it's not white and not a male. It's actually, it actually is a male, but it doesn't have the privilege of male. Okay, I'm gonna see if I can get the poison powder. Hmm. Interesting. Let's just try to get the poison powder off then. Oh, we got it. Torka was poisoned. Overheat. Of course, that would kill me instantly, but um, it also does give me the opportunity to get some more stuff. Especially as our card actually fell, so that's a good thing. Now, I'm gonna use Satan. The problem is, Satan does have uh, its health drained. Already. But the poison also drains Torkoal's health, so this is perfectly fine. Um, Fear Potion. No, Fear Potion don't work on a dead Pokemon. Um, I want to use a revive on whichever Pokemon is first, so that is the Gullible. And why is not gonna kill me? Yep, figured as much. And I know that the thingy is gonna hurt you even more. Good. Use a water gun. Should be pretty effective. Oh wow, not as much as I hoped. Okay, that did a lot less than I hoped. I send out this one, and then I just use an revive to uh, to ensure that I'm to ensure my victory. Um. Okay, I'm kind of sad that nobody else gets this burn, but yeah, I kind of have to deal with it for now. That life. Yeah. You gotta waste another overheat, man. This is not good. Okay, a special attack fell. Harshly. So, what you gotta do now is I don't think you had another one. If you do have another one, then I am kind of a little bit fucked. Don't, you don't have one. Yes! Cool. This means that Flannery has been defeated by me. 966 experience points. Jesus Christ, that's a lot. Oh, I guess I was trying too hard. I've only recently become a gym leader. I try too hard to be to be someone I'm not. I have to do things my uh, things my natural way. If I don't, my Pokemon will be confused. Thanks for teaching me that. For that, you deserve this. And I got some money. And a rat. Oh, what? Boom, 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 boom. Yeah, we got Pelipper. Gullible evolved into Pelipper. Now we got Pelipper, the Gullible, to protect. Um, yeah, fine. Actually, that's it's fine. We can we can we can learn protect for now. Like we're gonna fly, learn fly either way later on. But protect is not it's a nice move for now. Ethan received the heat badge from Flannery. Thank you. I'm Flannered. If you have a heat badge, all Pokemon up to level 50, even those you get in trades from other people, will obey you completely. And it lets you use bo bo it lets Pokemon use the HM move strength outside of battle. This is a token of my appreciation. Don't be shy taking it. This is Overheat. This is one of the most handy um, attacks we can have for days again. Overheat. Cool. The move inflicts serious damage on the opponent. It also sharply cuts the special attack of the Pokemon using it. It might not be suitable for longer battles. That is true. Also, I just noticed that it really needs to be. But, you know, I'll, I'll keep on going for now. Because I'm not gonna have to pause the video. So I'm gonna move it, my camera again a little bit closer. I mean, microphone. I hope you can't hear that that much. If you do, I am sorry for that. I don't mean that to you. Hey, this me. Hey, May. Ethan, long time no see. Oh? While I was visiting the hot springs, you get some. You get the Laverite gym badge. You must have got a good Pokemon. No, I guess you raced some. I guess it would be okay for you to have this. We got the Go Goggles, where we can go through the um, 
thingy. Desert. He doesn't put away to go goggles in the key items pocket. What does go goggles? You have no trouble getting through the desert near Route Route 111. But wow, he's in challenging gyms. You're trying hard because you don't want to lose to me. I bet. Ethan, I think you. I sh I think I should challenge your dad in Battle Park Gym. Ethan, see you again. They really like to use your name too much. Like, no joke, even. Okay, nice. I guess we are going to the Battleborg Gym. But how are we going to do that, huh? How are we going to do that? Simple. And clean. Um, let's see what you got here. Oh, you got an item. Full restore, wow. You're getting some good items already. Well, I'm going to use the imprisoned a little longer. Are you, are you a battler? Oh. Oh yeah, it's true. You can't get back to leverage easily, thanks to this. But, before we actually go back to Rustboro and then to Battleberg, I want to show off some some neat little a neat little thing here. Um, but before we do that, um, I'm going to skip Trainer Battles once again, so um, yeah, bear with me. Okay, cool. Now, if I can go up <laughs> another trainer. Okay, I'm going to skip this again. Okay, now I think we can do this thing. Also, um, my Pokemon got damaged a lot, so I gotta have to grab that. Super Potion, I'm gonna give to um, this one, this guy. Also, I see Lightning has another item. I think Lightning actually has a new item every time you battle a trainer. No, I guess, eh. Could be worse, could be better. Let's see what we can get over here. Yeah. This is the place I want to talk about. These fossils. You got two fossils here. Root fossil. Is this fossil if this fossil is taken, the other one will sink into the sand. Take the root fossil anyways? Nope. I want to have this fossil, the claw fossil. If the claw fossil is taken, the other one will sink into the sand. Take the claw fossil away? Yep. This claw fossil we need for later on in the game, but you'll see why. Actually we're gonna do that in this episode, so. Yeah. Um, also, I'm going to use a little thing called a repel because I don't like to encounter Pokemon here. Thank you very much. Um, because I like I bought these repels for that specific reason. Now I'm going to go all the way down, and there's another trainer. So um, yeah. Okay. Once oh, we're back again. This is something we got to remember. This is in a desert all the way to bottom, so do remember that for a bonus episode later on. Um, there should be something here, I think. Yeah, I don't know. Cool. I found a DM, which is... A DM, I don't know. Well, let's see what the DM is. Um, 37 red sandstorm. Yeah. It would seem the most logical for it to be sandstorm. Let's see... Another trainer, cool. Uh, you know what this means. There we go. Trainer defeated. Oh, there's another item here. I'm gonna grab this item. Stardust. Whoa. Oh, you're back and get full in this game. I kind of forgot about that. Um. Let's see. We're gonna toss the ice heal. We, we never need ice heal, anyways. Stardust. We can sell this one gift pretty good. So, yeah. Now. Um. Now that that's done. Well, we're off. Fine. I didn't need to repel enemies anymore. Enemies. I said enemies. <laughs> yeah, I don't. And I don't need to do repel enemies anyways. So, yeah. Now we're going to go to the fifth gym. But you might say, like, wait, why are we going all the way over here? Well, you might have guessed already. The next gym is in Belleburg. Woods? No, Battleborg City. It's a city. I can't really comprehend that that's a city, but it's a city, really. But how are we gonna get there fast enough? Well, how about using the bike? The bike is probably really convenient to go there. Let's go! Whoa! Whoa! Bike time. 
I don't want to encounter any Pokemon here, so what do I do now? You might be asking. I use a Super Repel. So you're talking this way. I just wanted to do that for a moment. Okay, now we're here. And... Hey, it's this guy again. Oh, it's you. You're the person who won't not only held and be a better word but also got back my stolen package and even graciously delivered it to Slateport. Captain Stern informed us and the package arrived too. I thank you very much. Why, if, if I were a rainclad, I would shower on you with gratitude and hail you as a hero. For you, the most wonderful trainer, I bear good news. Recently, our company developed a new kind of Pokeball. A token of appreciation is their gift to your wonderful trainer. We got the repeat ball. Repeat ball works better if you already caught a Pokemon. Okay, it will be available on Rustboro, so that's cool. Yeah, if I'm correct, let's see if, the, if it's, it's the one that I'm talking about, the Pokeballs. Repeat ball. A ball that works better on Pokemon caught before. So yeah, if you want to catch more, multiple Pokemon at the same, of the same species, then yeah, that's, that's the way to do it. But we came to Rustboro for a different reason. We don't came, came here to, to buy balls or whatever. We came here to get a Pokemon. But what what Pokemon, you might ask? Well, you'll see here, I think. Oh wow, that's a Pokenaf. I can't. Plan to describe its features in detail. Nah, don't want to. Are you the one? Uh, nope. You're not the one. You're the one. No way, you're the one at the bottom, aren't you? Okay. I've been trying to develop a device that resurrects Pokemon from fossils, and it's working. Wait, the thing you have there, is that, is that a Pokemon fossil? Would you like to bring that Pokemon back to life? I can, I can with my newly developed fossil generator. Sure. Excellent, let's do this right away. He's not the claw fossil to the tree structure. Our fossil generator we've made is incredible. It was one drawback, it takes a long time to work. So, uh, how about you go f for a stroll and look around? What you gotta do here is you gotta go here and just try to keep talking to him until it's done. Thanks for the waiting. Your fossil place Pokemon has been brought back to life. The fossil was an ancient Pokemon Anorith. It was. We got a fossil. Once I think the Anorith you receive? Yes. Now, how are we gonna call this Anorith, you might ask? Um, something with Claw. I want something with Claw. Um, this is a good question. Something with a claw. I got something. Although this is not really fitting, I think it's fitting. You know, we're gonna call him after a hawk. And that also has a claw, you know? So, how about naming him after, um... The best character ever. Griffith. <coughs> so, for all the people who have seen Berserk, you probably hate me now. But yeah, Griffith did nothing wrong. It's true. It's a fact. Nobody can go around it. Battle Armor. It's an Eve one. Hmm. Pretty pretty okay, Pokemon. And it's a ground. Is it ground? No, it's rock type, right? Rock and bug. But it is able to learn ground attacks, so that's good. Because we might need that later on. Now, we got a full party. Although one of them is not really that functional, but, you know, it doesn't really matter. We're gonna learn HM to, um... What's it called again? I forget his name. Oh, yeah, Trump. Trump is going to be able to learn strength for Growl. Because we're going to do one after this, only one more, and which is... Um, dive. <coughs> no, actually, a Waterfall. Because... Ooh, I actually don't know which one I'm going to learn. Uh, I'll see. I guess there's more, there's more that I need. Um... Let's go on to the next part of the game. We gotta go to Battle City, of course. But now we gotta go to Battleberg City, because... What is Battleberg City, you might ask? Well, you might have guessed right. Um, you might not have guessed right. If you have, then good job. If you haven't, then... Bad you. Go be right. Next time. 
Oh wait, the boat is gone. Well, that's not good. What do we do now? We just go and learn to surf. Let's go over here and uh, talk to this guy. You're... Oh, yeah. Ah, you must be Ethan, right? Thank you for playing with Wally a little while ago. He's been frail and sickly ever since he was a baby. We have sent him... We have, we have sent him to stay with my relatives in Verdant Turf Town for a while. There's a lot cleaner there than it is here. What was that? Where's Wally? <laughs> Where's Wally? He's already left our Wally? I wonder where he could have gone by now. Okay, I'm not getting anything from you. Fine, I didn't want anything from you anyways. Wally's really happy when he told us that he called Pokemon. Really ages in the small like that. Okay, cool. Well, you might have guessed. This is what we're going to do next. We're going to tackle the gym next. But before we do that, we're going to save and then uh, end the episode. Boom. So that's really it for now. So yeah, we've taken on the, the, the um, Leverage Town gym. And now, we're, in the next episode, we're going to take on the Battleberg gym. So I want to thank you guys for watching and see you guys next time. Bye-bye.